We just received our first HH mic yesterday. Um, we expect to be flying them and putting them in the flight training schedule around the October, November time frame. Um, we received one, we expect to get six, and we currently have around 12 pilots right now that are trained and qualified in that um, newest version, but we still need a maintenance test pilot before we can actually put them on the flight schedule and start um, flying them regularly. So if something breaks, we've got a maintenance test pilot who can fix it and then return it to the flight line uh, ready and safe for the other air crews to fly. It's the Army's brand new and latest version of the Black Hawk helicopter, the Army's medium lift uh, transport helicopter. And it has an enhanced propulsion system, so new rotor blades uh, that increase the lift capability of the aircraft. It has improved engines, the GE 701 Deltas, so they uh, give us better thrust and performance. And then it also has a, an advanced digital uh, avionics system with better flight instruments and navigation systems. And it has a fully autopilot um, capability, which our Black Hawk uh, versions previous did not. It gives you so many more functions and features. Um, so it, in, it enhances your ability to focus on um, what's going on outside the helicopter, the navigation, whatever mission you're doing, whether it's rescue hoist, a sling load, um, a you know terrain flight, low level tactical mission uh, to transport troops or equipment. Uh, the system, the aircraft will fly itself if you set it up correctly and then that enables you to, you know, instead of flying the helicopter with your hands, um, to gain better situational awareness, monitor um, as the flight progresses so things that aren't planned or unexpected, you can handle those events easier. It's just a great thing for the 77th Brigade. It brings um, modern, new capability to the Arkansas Guard. So when it comes to a deployment overseas or an in-state response mission, we've got the, you know a new airframe. We've got new technology that are helping assist our air crews uh, perform that mission safely. So it's just a huge win for the Arkansas National Guard.